back with another video. Today I'm reviewing the Kobe Maba backpack. It's available on Full Locker, East Bay, Champs, the usual guys uh, for $79.99. I think there's like five or six colorways. Uh, I personally went with the black just because it's, uh, I don't know, it gets, doesn't look as dirty. But uh, let's get right into the review right here. So on the front pocket right here, you got an insulated section right there. And uh, it'll keep all your cold stuff cold, your hot stuff hot. Other side pockets right here. I usually just keep my drinks, extra socks, whatever accessories you need right on the side right there. Same with the other side, right there. On the top pocket right here. Just really small pocket, you keep your glasses in there. Whatever small things, I usually keep my cap sleeve in there for uh, easy access accessibility right there um, also advertise these guys skins calf calf sleeves really really nice they're really expensive but I caught them at Dick's Sporting Goods for like 27 bucks or something for a pair uh, let's get into the front pocket right here I usually keep my shoes in here also has uh, a laptop sleeve but uh, it's not padded it's not gonna keep anything protected at all Usually keep my pump in here as well for basketball. Uh, got some trying out some new uh, energy drinks. We got the Meal Sport Powerade. I don't, know, I don't. I think you save some money buying these instead of the bottles. But uh, you guys, let me know. Maybe you guys have tried it. But uh, here we are. This is the inside right here, and then you got the ball inside right there. It's all along the bottom right here. As soon as you unzip it, there's your ball. You can also throw a pair of shoes down here if you'd like, or if you're just lazy like me sometimes, I just throw it in there with my shoes as well. One downside to this backpack is uh, at the price point that you're paying at $79.99, uh, there's no max out of straps, so uh, I thought that was a really bu a bummer. And uh, you also get these buckles on the side for extra security if you'd like while you're strapping across your back. Overall, this is a really nice backpack, but uh, again, just really bummer that there's no max air straps. Uh, really nice color blocking on this backpack itself, in my opinion. And uh, you can put a ton of stuff in here. Probably put your friend's stuff in here as well if you really needed to. Uh, I might pick up the Nike Hoops Elite Max Air backpack as well. Um, heading to the States in a couple weeks. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this review, uh, and I'll uh, catch you guys later. Peace.